Welcome everybody, here's your strategy wolf and welcome back to Old World and our Carthaginians in the Oxhide uh, Carthaginian campaign. Welcome back with Bommelkar the Ambitious and we are ambitious indeed, um, chasing down our epic victory for which we just have to um, yeah, adopt professional army and we are rushing as fast, uh, yeah, that, this one is an exception, but we are pushing towards it and we just need composite bow and manor and then we can adopt it. And we're doing everything in our cities at the moment and uh, as for example in Carthage itself, like the inquiry over here, to push our um, yeah, research output that we can speed it up as fast as possible. All right, um, I don't want to lose too much. Yeah, last episode, just to remind you guys, we've been trying out a little bit of exploration and how we can build a bridge of our three biomes over here. In case you've been wondering always in Old World, this mechanic is a little bit weird from my point of view. Um, have a look in the last episode and you will see how this works. Um, apart from this, yeah, we're keeping the peace with the Numidians and just trying to uh, build up our cities over here. We shall see how this continues next turn. Alright, let's get in. All right. Always having be, uh, yeah, always this this illness and disease is wave is going on even further. Yeah, some more ill people. Our Prince Caroly is improved even more by our and oh, Tabiba's um, teachings. So our son and main heir is really quite competent. I think we should have a look if we can find some place where we can get in as in a governor role. And we are known to as Bomilkar the Enlightened, not the Ambitious anymore. 40 Legitimacy, wonderful, which increase indirectly also our orders. And of course now we're going for the Composite Bow, which is... Uh, I'm kind of happy the our research is increasing, we notice, and therefore also the research time is going down. Just four turns, very nice to see. The Public Purse. Now that Orea thrives, its elders wish to do more for the poor. A proposal for welfare provisions in Orea reaches the court and debate begins. Imposing a grant of money for the hungry would reduce the state's fund, but it would set a powerful precedent. We would be seen as the protector of the people. Um, we've got the money. Um, so let's do the grain dole. Yeah, we can afford that. Establish a grain doll in Oea. Wonderful. Political questions. Basta the hero has had enough. Furious, he comes to you complaining that your child Arishtabal has been plaguing his child Pygmalion with questions and arguing every little point of the answers. When Bosca asked her to stop, Arishtabal just kept on asking questions until Bosta went away. Aristobal insists that she was honestly trying to understand their viewpoint, but Bosta argues that the child is mocking them. It seems that their studies are going well, aren't they? Um, uh, yeah, of course, our children, here's, uh, who's, he, who's him actually, Buster the hero, my brother-in-law, oh, yeah, but, is he even in a role, no, I, yeah, come on, it's our children there, we are still the leaders, uh, how are we doing here, yeah, we are, compassionate and humble, okay, let's role play, um, okay, then to get the children to study together is, yeah, we are humble, so then let's do this. Also increasing our wisdom a little bit. The end of autonomy. Uh, uh, so far, I, I, I was thinking last term we, we granted in an event some autonomy to Hadrumitum, and I feel like, I don't know if it's supposed to be like this, but in most of my games where these events happened, also the end of the autonomy came pretty soon after, but let's see. The city of Hadrumitum has become renowned as a free state of autonomous rule, a land to, unto itself. The court begrudges the situation, complaining that allowing such freedoms encourages others to expect the same. The situation reaches ahead when Queen Dawa Gadaido the Younger stands before the court and demands that something be done. Hadrumitum will not return to the fold without the use of force. Shall we fight to regain control? Uh, hell, okay, this is one I haven't seen. No, the city has earned its freedom. Yeah, this is, we are humble and compassionate, definitely not. Uh, all right. So if we, here, uh, oops, here we are. I just actually noticed we've apparently got tradable pearls out. Okay, so we can bring some out and probably to a Hanunit city. Oea is already doing Ah, oh. it's a, it's an interesting destination. Um, Hadrumitium is having pearls already. Oh no! So yeah, actually Hadrumitium then, because it's way bigger and more important. That and we will get the pearls over here. 
which makes them stick at four, so already quite nice. If we build a theater or something, they will go down. All right, um, where do we get in? We have no workers to do anything. We've got, yeah, we've got the chancellor now, which we wanted to have as a kind of, um, yeah, an exception, not because we normally want to speed up here the the process, but in this case, and. We've got so many civics, so we can even exchange and I think I'll put my our son Carly in charge. So uh if a governor post gets free, for example, if we die or something, we'd substitute him. But here he can get some experience and he's pretty neat also in his skills, so yeah. Carly can get his first um yeah, wonderful experience over here. And does he actually we should get also some kind of marriage out? Is there is there anybody especially interesting for us right now? Uh, it look, no, 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 I don't think so. So we go actually for the family marriage. Uh, all of them like it, but let's go with the lowest with the hat on it then. And yeah, what I wanted to do, I improved here a little bit further since um, no to him. Why can't I? Oh, we already influenced him so sad we can't do anything about it. Um, we can tutor somebody, then just tutor our daughter. And she can be tutored even further, so Tabiba does it again. So yeah, get these kind of things out. Uh, guys, remember, sometimes this is a thing, in my opinion, quite important button, so these ones I kind of... E ignore most of the time see summaries but this one just if you don't know this one here you get like all these extra actions but always keep in mind the cost orders and a lot of time civic as well so you probably can't also do all of them um let's keep our wonderful exploration going on let's see if we can well, i would like to find at least gibraltar and here also in the atlas mountains i want to see all of the map oh even a shrine i didn't expect this to happen very nice. You guys have been exploring the shrine, so you just chill over here for the moment. Um, okay, here we've reached also the end. This is the end. Oh yeah, and you guys... Nope, you just chill over here. So for the next bridge, we, when we want to get him back at some point... Let's test my theory with the two rings and then maybe the next ship we post here so maybe we can see how big we can build it what kind of a massive bridge we can build all right oh we ran out of ran out of orders so right good for us the fisher has been completed um and then for more it's getting another accurate out yeah we are focusing on research. Let's end the year. Uh, I I don't know if it's just the, me noticing these days, like since we have more and more uh, characters that the illness and everything is becoming uh, yeah bigger. But I feel like every day we have a lot of illness going on still. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Hamilcar the Superstitious has died and Matan, okay, with 21, that's quite young, we'll see. Uh, first of all, we get the family, the marriage offer for Karali, who is 21 and she's 24 and 26. Okay. Satan Bal of Rhea. Or Sunbuck of Rhea. Oh. Uh, yeah, Satan Bal of Rhea. Come on. A greedy scholar or horse bane tactician. We want to have two scholars. So, judge and a scholar. Yeah, they're going to be so wise. All right, we've got this. Um, our chancellor can be sent on a mission. I could potentially pacify cities. Actually, how much does it cost? I forgot. Um, kind of a cool thing to do. 100 civics and two orders. We just need to keep in mind we need always the 400 as a the one so we can act professional army once it's out there. Um. Level, 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 level. And I think then we go for... What actually happens with Pacify You? Come on. 
sometimes the UI or I'm so stupid, I don't know. What does it mean again? Happiness level, one direct happiness level. So it's not an uh, increase in the decline. So then I'll go for Hadromitum since they had four and we can lower this. This would be amazing. So and they don't even go up. Perfect. Um, visit them. And Ambassador. Yeah, we don't need the Ambassador in this scenario. Let's keep on going over here. Yeah, and we already see it down here. I want to connect the incense and build the growth since we can. We most recently learned how to do that due to technology. And over here, we we'll shall do the same and get these olives connected. Wonderful. And then we are left with our exploration and we find geoglyphs. Nothing about the hulking dirt mound seems impressive at first, not until our troops explore the adjacent desert hills till they return with news. At a distance, these primitive ruins comprise a massive pattern, designs and even zoological images made to be seen from a great height. Who knows what riches lie beneath the mouths, but to dig would destroy their beauty. Alright, um... Yeah, create a national historic mo a monument, of course. We have so much money. These 700, uh, this is not really worth it for us, so... Historic monument. And then... Let's go a little bit deeper into the atlas. But for me, it looks pretty much like... We also came to the end. Maybe this, this, these kind of clouds we have to discover. Will we find the shoulders of Heracles or what, however you call it, Gibraltar? No, Gibraltar is not being depict, depicted on this map. So yeah, you guys gonna move back in order to you know, build this experimental bridge. Uh, what is the militia can stay here forever. You guys move up. You guys also redundant over here. And you guys can be stationed here to kind of guard this flank. Troops can move up also. And the same with you. Alright. There's production to choose from in this case. Yeah, of course we need to get this city started. So the fisher is in this case super helpful. And uh, yeah, and another one down here in da -da 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 -da. Leptis Magna, and I guess we'll get the miner out. Yeah, it also extends the borders a bit. Very nice. And we've got one more unit to move. Oh yeah, actually I can move them further, so I will move them further. All right, let's get to the next turn. See, we're coughing up bloody mucus and suffering from sharp pains. Governor Yasmin the Younger, okay. Let's see what happens if, if, if uh, the, the autonomy of Padromitum goes back when she uh, dies or retires. Okay, he's no longer ill. They already got my grandson, Duke Matan, okay. Wonderful to see. And, okay, more conversions. Nasma the Younger, the governor of um, Takape. Takapi, Takapi, Takapi. I mean, it's a rider city, so maybe we shall. I mean, ca uh, cunning caravan access. Let's just go for it. Not that relevant for us here. The olives have been done, so let's go directly to the next one. Lovely. Um, same here with the incense. We kind of keeping we keep on building our groves. We finished the grocer. Lovely. And am I investing in another lumber mill over here? I think it kind of yeah. This is will be the woods that supply. I think they get adjacency bonuses from each other. Yeah. So these three forests over here will supply basically, roleplay wise, the massive Carthaginian fleet that's gonna be out there at one point. Okay, we we've, we've seen this wonderful. You guys can go back. Yeah, I mean, I could actually harvest these kind of things, but this is like these tiny details. Uh, I like how much we can move already here. And we will. Alright. 
Oh yeah, just you can stay here forever. Um, oh, we need a new governor down here for Area Philanorum. Or we finished the now we finished the Garrison. That's where it's coming from. And yeah, Princess Concert. Yeah, this is perfect. You can also learn to get a job. And over here we finished the Apprentice Oculite. Okay, we've got no um, no. We've got no civics available to, or no population to build another one, so we can either promote them, but I think the forum might be a good idea in the meantime. Yeah, in Hippo Regis. Actually, the forum also in Quarter Dust is, I think, kind of a necessity, but we finished the inquiry, inquiry first, of course. Our father is getting severely ill again. She's getting very wise also. Oh, and she has died, the governor of Hadramitum. We shall see if the autonomy keeps up. And, okay. Mediator. Sometimes the young see with clearer eyes than those with a wealth of experience. While studying politics, Duchess Arishad Balk has become a popular mediator, moderating disputes between fellow students, teachers, and even visitors to the school. One of her recent successes was a resolution of tensions between the Magonid and Hanonid families, longtime rivals. They are eternally grateful. Uh, okay, they get mediation plus 20 opinion, wonderful, and she should focus, or... No, she can teach, no? She's 14, but if she's that smart, of course she can teach. Getting some extra civics. Carved jewelry. Traders, tr traders from the farther south have arrived in Kardadash today, bringing with them an assortment of exquisitely carved ivory jewelry. While ivory is not unknown in our lands, the craftsmanship is beyond compare. It puts anything produced locally to shame. For the appropriate sum, the merchants will continually supply you with enough of this carved ivory to meet the needs of local elite or great family. Um, most definitely, uh, it will appear up here, so we're getting this, and for 1,400, it's like, oh, it's not much for us. And she has died in office, the governor of Hadramitum. Okay. Now, I kind of wanna... Yeah. Let's see where who we can bring in. Maybe then the queen consort, actually, yeah. I think this is the better choice, since we just put her to AR, but we didn't know. She'll go here, and Hannibal down here, you know, can... The Hannibal the Butcher? Wait, 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 what did I... Did we... Okay. Who is missing a governor right now? Ah, Aria Filano. Okay, Hannibal the Builder goes here. Wonderful. She can be tutored. Um, we will tutor her again. And we've got... I, ah, we're getting the ivories. I thought they would um, get out on the map. No, we're getting the ivories directly in our control. Interesting. Nobody's being really interested in that. Can you go? I didn't know. I, uh, is happiness... Is it getting better? And the more happiness we get, the more bonus we get? So in this case, anyways, I mean... We'll get giving the ivory to Carthage. Alright, and then let's focus on our builders again. Out here we bring, yeah, come on, elephants, connect them with a camp. Over here we finish the Shrine of Tanit. Now let's, yeah, a Garrison, so we can get also a governor out over here. Hadrumitum. Yeah, two adjacency bonus, this, this hamlet is a good idea. And you can stay here forever, you good guard. Um, so are you. You are moving up further. And also then you can actually fortify. These guys, yeah, well. Uh, too far away, I can't harvest you, okay. Then I'll move you back here to the coastline. You lovely people, okay. Where would... Uh, do I want them here or something like this? here in this this zone time for the testing but it should be it should be here i guess no, it's not time for the testing oh let's do a force mass we have the do we have the trading yeah easily but i can't anchor okay i can't anchor well not the most efficient play but uh i think uh it's gonna be okay we will survive that one 
let's get the gardener out so we also have orange uh, oranges olives is luxury and here we are that's already this turn again and go to the next one and yeah wonderful Carly helped a lot over here um, my father made an am another amazing recovery with his 79 years old perfect and now yeah we're definitely going for Maynard oh, still six years I hope with the end of the inquiry probably it's going to make a huge jump since we should get uh, 120 how yeah, we get 120 research this is quite helpful all right let's keep on going what we have to do uh, we can send him to another pacification of a city uh, which one is the next one to go we've got this content three and then i think hipporegius is the smart or reasonable answer yep over here let's what are we building over here actually Sometimes these records see you guys uh Hamlets get bring you 20 money if they're connected to trade no network, 10 if they don't. I don't know why this one is recommending to build it over here. Uh a little bit odd. Yeah, we're not building the Hamlets. Let's build the the Edrogen. Yeah, if, why not? Alright. You guys can anchor now. But I think it starts only next turn. No, it already works. And yeah, theory confirmed. Oh, I would have luck. Well, let's do actually undo for a second. Okay. So actually, this doesn't play a role. With by undoing, apparently the anchoring range is so high. How far is the anchoring? I mean, it must be almost three for each ship. So okay. It's pretty powerful. More interesting. We don't need you guys actually over here, so you can oh, remove these last clouds. So basically, we know oh, this is no, or not, but we know all the map now. All right, you guys stay here, please. You guys, I don't know, harvest, I can harvest wine. That's actually not so bad. Getting some culture for Hibberigius, very nice. And we've got production to choose from. Militia has been completed. Then we'll get the apprentice out. Over here we get also an apprentice out. That's what we... And then let's jump directly to the next turn. We shall see how much the inquiry will help us. <laughs> oh, but now after recovering, it's an up and down with our party. With, with age 8, he's constantly shaking and leaving him barely able to walk. That's hard to see. But okay, and yeah, the tribute to Tyre, again, we'll send just some some food. We don't need it. Um, it's perfect. All right. Um, ah, he's just, it's just repeating the inquiry all the time. Interesting, I didn't even know. I apparently have to end it since it was just done and restart it again. So maybe 120 isn't even that much anymore since we got it up so hard. Um... Maybe I'd prefer to get <laughs> then the apprentices out first. Also the apprentice shopkeeper, since they all provide two um, further wisdom or research, not wisdom. And uh, they just provide one. So let's do this. And then just for the sake, the forum afterwards. Uh, yeah, Carthage is um, busy training specialists. What else is going on? The ambassador is busy, is uh, not uh, idle, so whatever. We've got the grove out here. So let's build. Isn't this the one that gives per grove? Yeah, so why would you recommend it over here? And that's, we're gonna build the shrine of Ashmoon finally, profiting from the groves. Over here, I said I wanna make this our Carthage's lumber area, the forest that supply our massive upcoming fleet. Uh, you can just. Scout and chill. And you, yeah. Harvest the horses, why not? Can we harvest over here? Sorghum, yeah, this, this is almost well, it does have no value since we just get extra food, but alright, it is what it is. And you guys. Ah, oh, yeah. We want to scout here the last remaining clouds on the map. In Takapi, we've 
One, two. Let's get the vaults out just here. They have kind of a, yeah, not strategic, but yeah, Hadrumitium on Takapi. In case of a Numidian attack, I feel like these would be quite sensitive spots that would divide our empire. So let's build the vaults. <laughs> Sounds like a. Sound, sound like a familiar, uh, popular, and fam uh, not familiar, famous US president with the wall. Let's see. <laughs> okay. Getting too jokey here and uh, uh, in the last turns of this campaign. Hopefully we're getting, getting there, we're getting there. Courage, King Dawaga has died. Finally our father is dead in age of 81. Not finally, and it's not a relief what I'm saying, it's like... After all these up and downs. Sad story. Okay, and we've got opposing views from our smarty Arishta ball. She comes to you during a break from the academy seeking guidance. Two opposing factions of thought dominate my discussions and studies. One holds that the fates di direct the ways of mankind, so we must accept all events with a stoic tranquility. The other states that the gods are indifferent and fickle, and those we should uh, look to ourselves for enrichment of the mind and body. Arishat Bal sighs heavily. Which of these is the right way? Ooh, gracious or superstitious? Money and knowledge are the root of all power, educated or greedy. And this is the style that's going on right now, no? Playful criticism. A scribe in Hadrumitum has staged a series of narrative performances in which characters are played by a cast of actors reciting dialogue. It is an odd yet interesting development. Sadly, much of his work involved the heated criticism of the court's politics. In one instance, he likens you to the stench of an overflowing latrine. Normally, we might support this exciting new voice, but the content gives us pause. Uh, we can't. Why can't we? Okay, it's seven virtues. We can't. Honor the scribe. Support the arts, even those arts that challenge us. I mean, the families love us, so. Ah, come on. The families love us. Okay, and we get some extra bonus on something else. So we go for the civic. And here we are again. What are we building next? Uh, mm. No, here we want to grow. Yeah, of course, now we need the sorghum over here to make the city grow a little bit, so the farm is prioritized. Um, here we finish this growth. This one is getting already the adjacency bonuses. Absolutely wonderful. Um, oh yeah, here the quarry actually is a good idea. Next turn. And, yeah... Let's harvest some elephants. Let's do yeah. Apart from this, let's harvest some goats. Let's make use of our scout and the resources in the area. And then uh, try to check out what's going on over here. But that's basically it for the moment. She can be tutored. Let's do it again. Our son is still busy. So let's jump to the next turn already. Um. Yep. Hasdrubal is suffering from a high fever. Okay, stuff is going on. Nothing super special. Oh, and my dad, Arishat Bal, hasn't become educated. She's become greedy. Sad. A popular board game. A new game has become popular in Oispiridis. Rumor that is the game is a variant of another game played in a far off lands, though nobody knows for sure. Whatever the origin, the game is remarkably simple, needing nothing more than a series of holes and some seeds or stones to be played. Players place their seeds in pits as if it's sowing. On each turn, the players rearrange their seeds across other pits, trying to capture some of the opponent's seeds in the process. The winner of this game can claim to be a more accomplished planner and landowner. I think I've played this kind of a game in, in, at a beach as a child. So maybe this is referring to something for real. I guess it is referring to something real. Uh, we get the gains in Oisperides, definitely. Politics studies. Okay, Arishat Bal has... Uh, become a god of age and she yeah god we want her an orator not a hero um okay and she needs to our next daughter no relative it's our nephew niece probably she'll study uh, she can go to the world okay arishat the exotic of leptis magna has died in office let's choose a new one gisco the humble 
absolutely you're quite stable so you get in there all right and here we are let's finish off what we again we have a lot of um yeah uh, orders so not so much to do we've oh, our son is back so he can pacify a city again let's go for takepe now to bring some variation in the game and as a heir he can already learn our uh, yeah, realm and what's going on m5 theater mm. First to build something basic and get just another lumber mill out. Over here, um, I'm actually not sure if, if the damage of our workers is influencing the building speed. I doubt it. So also here, yeah, lumber mill it is this is the actually the artis, uh, artisan family and gives us some extra bonus, the Magonets. And over here we wanted to build the... This is marble, right? Yeah. And we definitely want to build the quarry over here. All right. Then, yeah, our scout. We make some space so you can harvest this lovely ore. Yeah, that's it. And over here. Well, so we have we know all the map now. Ah. Nothing miss. Oh, here. Oh, here's something missing. I guess there's probably the super rich island hidden below these the fog of war. Anyways, I had the production. Yeah, let's get the gardener out. I want to. Yeah, the, the olives. I definitely want them in the luxury system. And I think there's nothing more to do. And I think this is also the perfect moment for us to end this episode. Um, yeah. As a quick reminder, two more years in manner and then one more technology to fulfill finally the professional army for our epic victory that we are envisaging. How much time is left? Uh, oh, not so much. We have only got 21 turns also left, so we've... But we're gonna make it. I'm quite optimistic right now that we're gonna make it, but we've invested also hard. So yeah, uh, gonna be interesting. Once again, uh, since this um, yeah, let's play is coming slowly to an end, or at least not this this campaign, let me know or the scenario. Uh, what do you want to see next? Shall I just continue with the Carthage campaign? Would you like to see a different kind of old world game? Shall I maybe check out the new DLC with the Pharaohs of the Nile? Let me know you what you think about it. I would just happy would be super happy to interact with you and talk a little bit about old world. I'm always still excited playing this game. So thanks a lot. And also, of course, if you haven't let, please leave me a like and a subscription because uh, it costs you nothing and helps me a lot and uh, motivates me and grows this channel. So thank you for this. Apart from this, just see you next time in the next episode with our Carthaginians and our road to glory. Thanks for watching. Bye, your strategy wolf.